This is Lane Hardy. He won season 17 of American Idol and was heralded as a quiet, good old country boy from Livingston, Louisiana. On Thursday night, Hardy shared this. That led to this. Then the New York Post uncovered this. He's charged with a felony and details about what he allegedly did are beginning to spill. The crime carries a serious sentence if convicted. I'm Addison Hager with Taste of Country, and officially, all Team Hardy is saying is he'll continue to cooperate and please give him some privacy. That's a summary of a note written by his lawyer shared with Taste of Country. The 21-year-old said a little more on Thursday night when he recognized charges were coming. Quote, Earlier today, I received a warrant due to allegations made against me and have been fully cooperative with the Louisiana State University Police Department. Due to the sensitive nature of this allegation, I humbly ask for privacy at this time. I have the utmost respect for the law and will assist in their investigation as needed moving forward. So what did Lane Hardy allegedly do? He's accused of planting an audio recording device like this one in his ex-girlfriend's dorm room at LSU. Officially, that's one count of interception and disclosure of wire, electronic or oral communication, a felony according to this affidavit first obtained by the New York Post. The alleged crime was committed between February 12th and February 20th, and the arrest report is filled with details. Police became involved on April 7th, the night after the victim discovered what she would learn is a recording device. She immediately pinned it on Lane, and you'll see why in a second. On that recorder, police found several recordings of someone who sounds like Lane as he walked to plant it, and of the victim as she talks with roommates. During one conversation, police say you can hear the victim talking to her mom about breaking up with Lane. The second to last recording from February 20th is her saying she figured out he was recording her and doesn't know if the bug is still in her room. The reason she was quick to point to her ex is because she says she found a fake Instagram account on Lane's phone that he used to cover up that he was illegally recording her. She says she confronted him and he admitted to it, but said he chucked the device in a pond. Later, he admitted it again via Snapchat and she provided those pictures to the cops. That's kind of a lot of detail, I get it. But to summarize, a woman who says she is Lane Hardy's ex-girlfriend told police that the singer was recording her conversations with this device and provided enough proof to police that they issued an arrest warrant. He allegedly hid it behind a futon in her dorm room at LSU. Lane would eventually turn himself in and pose for a mugshot. The crime carries a maximum penalty of a $10,000 fine and up to 10 years in prison. As of early Friday morning, he was still in prison, waiting for a bond to be set per Baton Rouge TV station WAFB. The Post says that they dated from November 2020 to February 2022. It's worth noting that while Lane and his lawyer issued statements, nobody denied anything or tried to say he'd be cleared. If there were any photos of the two on Instagram, they're gone now. I'm Addison Hager with Taste of Country. Thanks for watching, and as always, Thanks for subscribing.